All right, welcome back, The Always Garage, part five, project tow hitch, etc. Right, now this today, I just wanna, I just ground off a little bit of this protective finish that I put on, because uh, I'm just gonna deal with these top bits here. So this is just a, a start. Just strengthening these up, really. I think that's strong, proper strong now. Um, the way that I beat the life out of the test piece uh, has proved that it is strong. So these ain't going anywhere. Um, the back half will still be dealt with yet. But these pieces here, I'm just sort of overnight had some thoughts that I could probably improve the strength of that. That's the pivot point where it bolts onto the bike. Um, it's all quite strong, it's double bolted through, it's welded all the way down, but this top section, I don't know, just being open just feels a little bit like I could do better. So just today, I'm just gonna use these little bits of scrap and stuff. Just gonna cut some little squares out of this and just weld in a little plate on the top of each one of these and then grind it round so they're effectively capped. Uh, just gonna make them stronger. Boxing anything in always makes it stronger, simple as. So just gonna cut one of these out and I'll show you what we've got so that I can then start grinding them and prepping them. Okay, stick around, stay tuned. just TIG welded in or not as that bit wasn't so it can just be snaps off a bit of work hardening there we go right bring you over here so that's done all four it's got these little squares. The reason I'm using this steel is it's exactly the same as the steel that I'm welding to and I haven't got any other. And it's just a bit of scrap. It's reasonably suitable for the job in hand. So that's gonna go pretty much on there and then weld across the top. Uh, then weld up underneath and then just cut off the excess, I think it's the easiest way. Just gonna box them in. It will make them stronger, not by a great deal, but every little helps. Sort of cumulatively, there's four of these and they're all sharing the weight, blah, blah, blah. So let's get these prepped. I've done a couple of them. I just wanna get them on the grinder, grind all the chrome off. Give the world the best chance it can to stick. Let's get them ground up. There we go. Eight neatly made little tabs. I mean, if I had a sheet of metal, I could just cut little squares out, but that would be as much work as this, so it makes no odds. There we go. Eight little squares. Now, the old grinding wheel. I've just cut the top bit out, but I've also got some other ideas for this section here where this tab finishes at that point. Just got an idea for some reinforcement around here so that doesn't crack across there. So let's stick around, I'll show you what I mean by that. Right, 
just using the old tube that I've already used. I'm going to cut it down the centre, make it as a collar. There we go, basically making two half tubes. And these will go quite simply from that point where the, about there, where this piece of quarter plate finishes, which will come sort of half that distance, just notch out around the bolts. And then that will be pressed on so it fits on and then welded down the outside around the bottom. Now that will just double up the thickness of the steel and add more strength to the length, as they say. So that's all that is. Um, I'll notch out around those bolts when the time comes. So that will be all good. Um, I've just got to do, so that's those done. Two of those done. I'll do the last two. Get it all prepped for welding. Here we go, right. Just bring your your rear. Uh, that's time out for me now. Some total of today's shenanigans. I've just prepped these half tubes, which is properly ground the chrome off to get a decent weld on that. And I should do some test pieces. I've got some extra spare bits which I'll use as test pieces when I start doing this. Uh, but they are going to be to each side, round each one of those further down. So effectively it gives them extra strength, it's just kind of reinforcing really. So that's those ready. There's the little tabs ready for the tops. And I've run out of time, got to go to work. This new shift job, it's uh, 12 o'clock now. Got to get to work for our plus one. So I'm out, got to go to work. So that's it for today. That's all. Everything prepped, ready for tomorrow. So tomorrow's late shift, I should be grinding off or wire wheeling off this, this uh, coating. And then actually, now I've got the welder half decent, got the settings half decent. I shall start welding these in place and strengthening up the main spars before we start doing the geometry. Okay, there you go. Thanks for tuning in and watching Doors Garage. Ride safe, everyone. See you next time.